Hey, Joe Muirhead here. It's been a while, hasn't it? Firstly, I wanted to say a massive, massive thank you to all of you who have been so incredibly supportive of me as I've gone through my cancer journey. Not all the way out the other side yet, but I am starting to feel better, a little bit better every week. And oh, I can tell you, it was so wonderful to receive the news that there's no evidence of disease, which means I'm cancer free uh, and I can start to rebuild <laughs> my wellness and my health. Uh, thanks, cancer treatment. And I've had this opportunity over the last 12 months to watch and observe, look at the behaviors of health professionals, look at the behaviors of consumers of health professional services. And I'm now at a point where I want to make sure that I'm actually adding value. There is so much noise. Have you noticed how much noise there is? And it clutters our brains and all of us are probably struggling with information overload and screen overload and all the pivoting and changing and the need to be agile that we had to do in 2020. And I don't want to add to any confusion or any noise. I just don't want to be another email that lands in your inbox once a month or twice a month because I'm not going back to once a week right now. I can assure you of that. So my, my whole purpose in wanting to uh, support health professionals, particularly health professionals in private practice, whether you're the owner of the practice or you just work in private practice, is that I genuinely believe that private practice is how we are going to see the changes that we all desperately say that we want in healthcare. It's not going to come from government. It's not going to come from really big corporates. It's going to come from us, those of us who are doing healthcare at the coalface and building teams or building other ways of helping people get the needs met. So I don't know if you're aware of this, but what I can see happening is there's massive need, massive need in Australia, massive need in the UK, massive need in Europe, massive need in Asian countries, massive need in the USA. There is so much need that we actually don't have enough health professionals to do the work. And what concerns me is that when I wrote my book, The Entrepreneurial Clinician, back in 2017, 2018, burnout was huge among health professionals. We had this churn and burn mentality. We can't keep, we can't keep doing it. There's, we've got less options now. Um, if we don't stay the course, if we don't work out what it is that we need to do to be able to turn up every day, how to look after ourselves so that we can serve our people in the best way possible, then there's going to be less health professionals available to meet more need. And we all know what that's going to mean. That's going to mean substandard care. That means people aren't going to get the care that they need. And that concerns me. It's always been my desire to serve, to encourage, to inspire, and to kick you in the pants if that's needed. I'm a bit of a truth teller. Uh, I like to poke the bruise to make sure that we can get massive transformation in a short period of time. So I'm curious to know, for those of you who take the time to watch this video and answer, respond to my email or this social media post, how can I help? What is it that you would really like to learn more about? What is it that I can bring to this conversation that will help you feel inspired, encouraged, affirmed, and sometimes a little bit challenged? So I encourage you, if you are watching this on social media, please direct message me or put it in the comments like, Joe, I really want to learn about this. Or reply to the email if you're getting this video via email. Reply and let me know, Joe, I really want to learn about this. Nothing's off the table right now, people, uh, unless you want me to be a tech guru. That's not my ballywick. I don't do tech guru stuff. But I'd love to know from you how I can help. Really looking forward to seeing the responses and really looking forward to becoming more and more engaged with this work as my health improves. Go be your awesome self.